How y'all doing today? So here's a quick update of my uh, personal portfolio account. And the thing that's pretty cool today is this swing trade position that I picked up, which my cost basis, as you can see, was a thousand dollars, and I am up twenty three eighty six. So two point four percent gains, pretty sweet. Not quite my exit point. Um, my exit point. Uh, oh, that's not what I was looking at. Okay, here we are. So my exit point is somewhere around 570. So somewhere somewhere in that range. I was looking at about like yeah, 570, 572 or whatnot. Um, is what I want my exit point to be. So I'm not quite there, but pretty close. And then when I get to my exit point, I will sell that out. Let me make sure, yeah, is that my exit point I want? I believe so. Yeah, that's definitely going to be my exit point. <laughs> okay. So once I get to that exit point, I will liquidate that position, which will probably give me about 140 you know, about a $50 gain, which is pretty nice. And I might um, add more to these or find a new one. You know, really it's just a waiting game. Today, um... You know, things are looking pretty good. So, still, the account's down for the day. You can see that uh, 65.85 down here. But, I think things will come back. You know, and then I did get some money, but I'm like, I had to pay other things. So, I was like, eh. So, slow price less, but it's uh, still coming along. Everything else, obviously, is about the same. Not much change. And I'm starting to get to a point where I can uh, look at liquidating something. So that's pretty nice. Uh, this is the what I went over yesterday. Uh, good thing again, you know, some things are going green. So that's pretty nice. Um, I'm still waiting before I re... Uh, hate when I can't remember words. Okay, so I'm still waiting to put this money in different areas until, you know, these reds start to come down. Or the um, other funds that I picked get more appealing to me. So hopefully bonds come up more, those ones get more appealing, then I switch them around and whatnot. So, but today this, you know, 401k is up 187. So my personal account is down a little bit, the, the 401k is up, so that's nice. Um, on side notes, uh, some cool stuff that I was looking at, because you all know I'm a diecast collector. I was thinking about picking this up. It's on eBay. Uh, I haven't really decided, because I have some eBay credit, you know, and I could like buy one and whatnot, because I like to collect cars. But I was thinking about picking this one up, because John Lightning Monopoly. I like to collect white lightning monopolies. I don't really have many. I actually only have one, but I want to improve that. But I thought that was pretty cool. And also this one that I seen on there, but I can't buy this one because the person's asking $500. And I'm like, that is a super awesome van. I don't have, uh, I don't think I have a single van in my diecast collection and I have a lot of awesome cars in my diecast collection but I do not think I have one van at all I'd like to have that one too but $500 is too much for me this one here I could probably pull off because it's only like I don't know 85 bucks so that's not bad for a, for a cool white lightning Pennsylvania railroad it's pretty dope but yeah just a little side note of some cool stuff that I like to add to my collection and what else oh yesterday I went so we went to this Christmas parade this is like off track for what you know the things here but there's this place where you go eat right there buy it and then they had a flaming young like a five ounce and then they had like a like eight ounce one or whatever never had one before you know and I was with my folks and my girlfriend so I was like I'm gonna try one of these you know it was like forty dollars for that thing but I was like mm, I want to try one 
been a long time since I went to a, a nice restaurant like that. So I was like, yeah, it's pretty good. You gotta admit, like you see them on TV all the time, all the fancy people are like flaming young, you know, or however you say it. I don't know. But yeah, it's pretty good. They even had a lobster tail. I wanted that, but that thing was like, I don't know, $45, $50 or something. I was like, I'm going to wait on that. But I'll try this steak and see what's up. But anyway, a uh, quick video of where I'm at. So, yeah, like the 401k is green today. So that's nice. Um, back over here to my personal account. It is red. But $66 in red, that's not too bad. Um, you know, so... I'm still, I'll still be able to do this better. I mean, yeah, so not too bad. But that's where I'm at right now, moving forward. So I made the changes on the 401k. As I mentioned, whenever those changes take place, I will show it. And any other changes that I do, really the only change I did was, uh, you know, here from yesterday. You know, these were the changes that I made. I just went from current changes, new elections, and these are my new elections. I did not switch any of the money to different funds or any of that. Um, when I do, because I probably will, at some point, I will make a video showing you all how I do that. That way, I can make that grow. And then, in the future, when I borrow against that, because I'm sure I'll do that too, then I'll put that money into... You know this private account and then this will be built up a lot better and then you'll just be able to see like the steps I take to make things work um, to my advantage to be able to build that wealth and a lot of it's just moving things around and knowing what you want to get into but a uh, quick video today just to show you all what was up what's going on with my accounts and so forth and hopefully um, I started getting some big changes here because unfortunately like I said I cannot add funds to this account um, this, you know, pay period and whatnot, things I had to take care of. Good uh, afternoon. So, yeah, we'll see what goes on moving forward. All right, so y'all have a good one. See ya.